It is with love, joy, and gratitude in our hearts that we come together to celebrate the union of Jacob and Catherine. All the days of their lives have been leading them here. All the decisions they make, all the choices they've made in their lives has led them to where they are right now. On this altar, Kendall Point, looking at each other in the eyes and smiling. As I look at this young lady before me in a beautiful wedding gown, I can't help but reflect on the little girl she was and a woman she's become. She became daddy's girl on the day she was born and has always been my baby. All through her life, she's brought love, happiness, and pride to her mother and me. Catherine and I met in college and quickly became best friends. So I've been able to witness her and Jacob's relationship pretty much from the beginning. And it brings me so much joy to know that Catherine will always have the love and support of someone like Jacob. He's a great friend. Um, and he's a, you know, he's, he's an even better man. And I love him like a brother. You sure know how to pick him, Catherine. You're, you're, you're a lucky man too, Jacob. You know, look at Catherine. She looks beautiful tonight. And more importantly, she's kind. She's a hard worker. And I wish them nothing but the best in their marriage. And I hope it's long and happy. And here's to the happy couple. Catherine, you are beautiful, you're radiant, you're caring. Jacob said he loves your playful spirit. He loves to be around you. He said he feels like he's a child when he's around you. That's what he said about you. He just loves your way of being, he said, and he said he liked you from the very first date at the Zinc Wine Bar. Ever since you were a young girl playing the flute in band, you've always been a kind, caring soul. And I know you will bring that into that marriage and that it will be a blessing for both of you. Jacob, you're strong, you're grounded, you're the, you're the port in the storm for Catherine. She said anytime she's stressed out, she can come to you and you make her feel better. You did the same for me during the speech. So you're always there to, to really keep people grounded. You're a caring soul, you have a lot of kindness, a huge heart, and you've been that way ever since you were playing baseball as a young kid. I know you'll bring that, that huge heart to this, to this marriage and that it'll be a blessing to both of you. So I've known Jacob since high school, and uh, we started hanging out and playing uh, poker on the weekends with the same group of guys. Over the years, we've had many talks and given each other advice, and I think the best advice I ever gave you was when you got home from your first date with Catherine, and I was at the house, and I asked you how it went, and you said, ah, I, I liked her, and I think it went well, but I don't know if there's going to be a second date or not. So then I said, yeah, hey, screw it, man. Let's just go out to the bar. We'll pick up some girls. We'll get some drinks, you know? Luckily for those of you that don't know, I'm a complete idiot. So he did not listen to me, and it's good that he didn't. This evening, as she has joined hands with a younger, wonderful young man, in addition to the drive and determination I have always seen in her eyes, today I see a love and joy there beyond anything I've ever seen thus far. Now she and Jacob complete each other as they become a new family. I wish both of you a lifetime of love, and I hope that you look at each new day as an opportunity to love each other just a little bit more. Whether it's for better or for the worse, as long as we're together, we'll make it through this. I knew 
that it was true from the very first time I kissed your lips. I know every day is a new adventure, and sometimes you may feel like giving up, but you just gotta look. Back and remember what we made of. Jacob said that he loved Catherine from the first time he met her at the Zinc Wine Bar. He said she was kind of grumpy during that time <laughs> because she was on a weird diet. She was on some weird diet. Millennials, I guess, were always trying out new diets. And ever since that day, he likes you. He still has a shirt that he wore on that day, which you said that you hated that shirt. You love Catherine because she's playful. You said she makes you feel like a child. She's so full of love and kindness for you. She always does things day in and day out to help you and support you. Catherine, one day you were just running on the treadmill and you just had a thought, it just popped in your head. And it was, I love Jacob. And you were just like, it sounds like a movie almost. You were just looking out the window, I love Jacob. And a marriage is a lifetime, but a wedding is just one day. So keep that in mind if you guys can choose love day in and day out, if you can choose devotion, choose to respect each other when you're together, when you're alone, when you're right and when you're wrong, no matter what's going on in your life, inwardly or outwardly, if you have that love and respect, you guys will be blessed with a marriage that will just grow in, in, and get better and better throughout the years. With this ring. With this ring. I thee wed. I thee wed. Catherine, take this ring, hold Jacob's hand, and repeat after me. With this ring. With this ring. I be wed. I be wed. I was skeptical of you at first, Catherine, for trying to steal my man away from me. But uh, after getting to know you over the years, uh, I guess you're okay. Nah, but seriously, Jacob, um, I've never seen him as happy as he is when he's been with you, and you make each other better, and it's been a pleasure to watch y'all grow together as a couple, and I can't wait to see what the future holds for you, so. Be true to each other always. Share your joys and your burdens. Love much and laugh often. Be each other's best friend. Always speak well of one another, even in private. And when things don't go well, forgive as often as it is required. Married life is an adventure, and you embark today on that adventure together. Please join us in wishing Catherine and Jacob every happiness possible and long and joyful life together as husband and wife. Salute.
Catherine, on this special day, I make a promise to love you, support you, encourage you, and protect you for the rest of my life. I promise to you that I will always be there for you. I will always be the person you can talk to about anything. I will always be someone you can lean on, and I will always love you forever. Jacob, you are the love of my life and my best friend. I love you more each day and know that our love will continue to grow with each passing year. I promise to continue loving you unconditionally and to never let us lose our spark. You're everything to me. I love you. Thank you.